Good morning, friends. Welcome back to She's in Her Apron. Have you made your bed yet today? This is the biggest motivator for me to start the day. Oh, I love it when the bed is made. It feels so good. Okay, so let's talk about my window. A lot of you have wondered, like, why don't you center your bed under your window? Or, okay, here's why. My bed, and it's a king size, is centered on this wall. It's centered on the wall, basically. The window is not in the middle of the room. So uh, what we're going to do is I'm still trying to find some curtains that match this. So I'm going to be hanging a rod that go further out from the bed and then finding curtains and we'll drape them in the middle so it'll look like it's one big window, but it's not. So that's what we're going to do to fix that problem, if that makes sense. I've got a yummy roast in here and I did my friend Jana's roast, uh, which is um, a chuck roast with a packet of Italian zesty seasoning, like dressing you would use, um, buttermilk ranch dressing and brown gravy. So that is in there, ready for dinner. I just got done in Costco. I went and got a new prescription. So I got new glasses and contact lenses and these feel so good. I think they're called Bosch, Bosch and Long Ultra. All it says in the receipt is Ultra. And they work if you have chronic dry eye and I have stigmatisms and they are supposed to breathe a ton better and you want these feel really good. I've had them in for an hour and a half right now and they feel really good. So I'm so excited. I love Cafe Rio. I love their salads. Their sweet pulled pork salad is so good. I like it better than Costa Vida. There's a little bit of a debate here in Utah but and in my home. But I went on their website and I ordered me a salad. And uh, I could pick it up at 1. It's 12.36 right now. And uh, I'm going to see. I've never done it before. I've never ordered and picked up from them. So I'm going to see if this worked. I've drank a lot of water the last couple days. I'm quite proud of myself. Since I am by uh, good old Sonic, I think I want a dirty Coke. I'm gonna go over to Shopco and see what they have for patio furniture cushion. Here's the one I got at Big Lots, and here is the ones from Shopco, the reversible. I don't like any other. These are tolerable. <laughs> so I lined up the seat seam. So this one has the headroom that we're looking for, that exactly what we need more. And it's perfect on the seat side. I swear. Picking out patio cushions has been a nightmare for over a year now. Last year, I just like gave up. Here's my Cafe Rio sweet pulled pork salad. Look at that, how good. I actually make this at home and I'll leave a recipe for you so you can watch it. But it is delicious. A lot of people like Costa Vida. I'm sorry, it just doesn't taste the same. The meat, the pork here is just, the flavor is amazing. It just cannot compare to Costa Vida. Love their dressing love their salad so oh it's so good i got pinto beans and rice down here but their lettuce is like huge i have to break it up a bit but this is my lunch so i'm gonna hurry well no you know what i'm not going to hurry i'm gonna sit and enjoy this and take my time before i get going with the craziness of my day hallelujah it fits oh my goodness perfect all the way to the top so I gotta clean off these two tables and uh, then get the cushions on. We have our big tent that we got, is it last year? I'll leave the video of where we got it from in the company. Um, so it pops open really big. What we're, go what we're doing to our yard is we're putting a um, cement patio down here so we can put the grills down on it. And then um, we're getting a big, like, <sighs> rod iron like canopy thing to go across our deck it only will do half of it and then we have the big umbrella and this is a swing Derek's gonna get the swing part out of the garage so we'll get all of this cleaned up and looking sharp you're eating my salad did you get pork mm-hmm I like uh cafe Rio salad better you see I can't tell the difference. Oh, there's a huge difference. Their sauce is the same. 
Nope. Pork's the same. Nope. Their lettuce is the same. Their tortilla is the same. Tortilla? <laughs> Their tortilla <laughs> is the same. Everything is the same. You're silly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, much time has passed, and I have potatoes in the Instapot for mashed potatoes. And I'm just whipping up a salad. I opened up a bag of the sweet kale salad from Costco. Now I just got to mix all this in together. Mmm, there it is. That's going to be so good. Mmm. Oh, so so good. Mm, there is dinner tonight. So good. So Joan and I are going to hurry up and eat because we are off to an ortho appointment and then home to get ready to end the night. Man, when the day ends, like my makeup starts falling off my face and <laughs> landing under my eyes. It makes it look like I have black eyes. Scary. Okay, it is the end of the night. Shaylee is crawling into bed. Derek actually surprised the boys and took them to a movie. They went and saw the Avengers, which I'm so jealous. So I'm gonna get going on my night routine and start picking up. So, oh, I do not wanna wake up to any mess and I just wanna start the day tomorrow clean and fresh. So I'm gonna get one step ahead and work on my night routine. Would you like to join me? Apron's on, let's go. Now when I wake up tomorrow morning and come through, it's gonna feel so good. Today was an amazing day of little blessings that came my way. <laughs> Jonah, he's so funny. Things that I heard today that I really needed to hear. One was from um, Samantha from Happily a Housewife. Oh, Samantha, you helped me out so much. In her vlog today, she said, she heard from somebody else, I can't remember who, about what would your future self thank you for? My future self tomorrow is gonna thank me in the morning when she wakes up and comes in here and the kitchen and everything is clean, ready for the day. And then I was listening to Allison's podcast today from the Allison Show and there were so many nuggets in there that I needed to hear about the, you know, setting your priorities, scheduling things, what's really important. In five or 10 years, is what I'm doing now that I'm really not liking or like how it's going, is that gonna be where I want to be in 10 years. No, I know where I want to be in 10 years. I know where I want to be in five years with like say she's in her apron. And so I'm going to be switching some things up and changing things up to fit and work for me and for my family and have better things for you guys. So there were so many wonderful nuggets that came into the into my mind today that I'm just so thankful for because things I've been thinking about and struggling with and it was like Heavenly Father's like here you go bloop 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 there you go I had some pretty amazing conversations today with a good friend on Marco Polo and it was like I know what I need to do I know what I need to do to move forward with family with she's in her apron and I'm gonna do it so thank you for joining me today uh, take 15 minutes to do your night routine your future self We'll be so happy. All right, we'll see you later. Bye.